Right, time to get to work. This will probably be one of the last times that I'll get to do relaxing work before proper work when I'm fighting against the when I'm fighting against the Bombulians. Oh, Josie! Oh, hey, Erica, what's up? Not nothing. I've not, not been seeing you all day. It's been a bit weird. Yeah, it's been a bit weird. I've been, uh, I've been out with Richard, you see, so that's yeah. why I've really seen you that much today. I've just been doing some work. When I say work, I mean I've just been relaxing all day because this will probably get. This will probably be the last time I'll get to relax before, you know, um, before we uh, get drafted <laughs> um, to fight against the Bongolians. Yeah. I know. When are you and Bonga actually going up into the ship? That's a, we've not had much updates on that recently. Yeah, I've not actually. Um, I mean, I don't know. Maybe Dr. Cali's just being very busy. I don't know. Yeah, that's probably it. Oh, getting a phone call. Hello? Uh, hello, uh, JC. Um, can you go to, around about the Domino's, can you go to, like, Domino's, the dentist, that sort of area? Uh, uh, there's gonna be a friend there waiting for you, and I, I, I just, you can stay on the call, um, the whole time, but, uh, yeah. just make your way over there, okay? Okay, okay, Dr. Right. Dahlia, right. I'm gonna mute up for, I'm gonna mute up for now, but, uh, I'll, I will, I will just, just start talking when, uh, when you get there. Okay, I'll talk to you soon. Okay. Who is it? Um, it was Dr. Callia, so uh she needs me to go over to um the area where Domino's is. I'm pretty sure that's where the rocket's being built. Oh alright. Okay, right. Well uh good luck. Um and I'll see you in a bit. See you in a bit, Erica. Love you. Love you too. Okay, Dr. Callie, I'm almost there now. Okay, so in just a second or two, you should be able to see the rocket. It's just, it's fully complete now. And you should be able to see a little friend uh, that you will, well, any second, you should be able to see a little friend, you see. Oh, yeah. Wait, is that Bonga? Yes, it is. Oh, hey, Bonga. Hello, JC. Um, I don't really know what I'm doing here. Well, just I got told to come here, and I, it, it, who, who's on the phone? Is that your phone? Oh, oh yeah, that's my phone. I'm just on the phone to Dr. Callie. She'll basically, uh, she'll cover everything for us. She'll tell us exactly what we need to do. Okay, so Dr. Callie, what do we need to do? Well, basically, um, you see, just go up the stairs and go on top of the go kart crazy. Okay, sounds simple enough. Okay, um, yep, there's, um, <laughs> there's the rocket. Um, I must say, it, it looks, <laughs> it looks really bright and colourful. Well, yeah, it's, it's our colours, it's the yellow, it's the normal yellow that we normally have. Um, well, basically, all I'm just going to do is I'm just going to, I, I, I'm away right now, so I cannot actually be there in person. But what I'm going to do is I'm going to give you a little explanation of everything that you're going to have to do when we strap you in the rocket and send you up to Galactica. Okay, so what exactly do you need to do, Dr. Callia? Uh, so, first of all, just uh, head up the stairs. Okay. okay. Again, sounds simple enough. Um, okay, do we just... Now, um, just make sure that you... Uh, you don't fall off, and uh, yeah, this is, uh, it's a bit, it's a bit of a tight walk, but uh, you should be able to make your way over, and then just simply head your way in. Okay, do you want to go first, Bonga? Yeah. Ooh. Okay, we are in now, um, he looks, he looks cramped in here, but I'm not complaining. Well, if you think it looks cramped in here, then look underneath. Oh. Oh. Okay, um, oh, wow, <laughs> I, I really don't know how you managed to fit all this stuff in such a tiny rocket, Dr. Callie, but, I mean, that, that, that's pretty impressive, I won't lie. Yeah, well, um, the thing is, one of you are going to have to 
to sit up in the seat upstairs, and then the other one is gonna have to sit downstairs. Oh, okay. Bro, I, I, I dibs, I dibs going upstairs. Sorry, JC, you're gonna have to go down here. Oh, okay. Um, anyway, continue, Dr. Callia. Um, yeah, so just make yourself familiar. You are gonna be able to put your stuff into all these little shulker boxes. Um, yeah, it's just nice little storage. Um, you may want to bring some things, like some food or whatever, like even some just like, like just anything to just keep you company while you wait. Because it is, it's, it's not that long of a trip in the rocket when you fly up, but it does take, it, I'm not going to deny that it does take a little while. Okay. Um, so if you could just head your way up now. Um, I'm just going to go over the basics. Um, so, um, I know this is the control room. Um, you're not going to be piloting the rocket. We've got someone else to do that. Okay. Um, so, like, you don't have to really worry too much. Just the rules of this room are just don't press anything, really. Okay. E except for the lever, of course, uh, next to the trap door. So I, can't, so I don't press this button? Don't press that! Don't press that! Don't press that! Oh, sorry. Sorry. I... Oh, what? It'll, it'll, it'll be okay. It'll be okay. It should oh. be fine, right? But it, what exactly fine. happens when you press the button? Well, it'll just send off the rocket, but there's no fuel in it right now, so we're all good. Okay, but if good, there then. was fuel in the rocket, then, um, yeah, you would have been blasted off. Yeah. We, wouldn't, we won't want that, would we? No, well... Yeah, well, what do these levers do? Can I at least flip these levers over here? Uh, yeah, they, they, they're, the, they're the mechanics that strap you into the rocket, so the, the one alone, one of you, so it'll be you, Bonga, you'll be, you'll have to flip them levers, and then it'll strap you into these, it'll strap you into the seat. And then, JC, you're just going to have to uh, kind of hold on tight, I guess, downstairs, because we don't actually have, it's such a cramped space, so we don't actually have enough room for another chair like this. So yeah. You're gonna have to just get comfy, I guess. Mm, yeah. But we've got a we've got a bed for you, so that's not the end of the world. Yeah. Uh, at least I get to. Uh, at least I get to um, to sit downstairs, and I've got a uh, I've got a bed down there. Yeah. Well, um, if we go outside now, I just want to show you some extra little things, just just so you all are aware. Okay. Um, if you go all the way down the stairs and go to the bottom of the rocket. Okay. Uh, so then what's the... You should see these this little floating little bit. It's actually not floating. It's like being held on by like very tight wires, very light. They're invisible wires. And um, those are just the thrusters. So that's where all the flames and excess fumes will be coming out of. Um, when you take off from when you leave anyway once again you will not be controlling the rocket so um you don't have to worry about that but um i just thought i'd be i just thought i'd let you know that this is where the flames will be and the fumes will be coming out of yeah okay well um thank you for clearing up dr callia um and then just make your way around just make sure everything just make sure everything looks okay make sure there's no holes in it because um mm -hmm. yeah we really don't want you to be flying up in a rocket that has a gap in it yeah cuz yeah that um uh yeah that could end badly hmm it 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 seems to be in perfect condition well, as of right now, anyway, as it, as it, as it stands right now, it, it seems to be in perfect condition. Well, that's good to hear. Um, I just, uh, I, I would just advise you to do the exact same thing for the little tower that makes your, uh, you can make your way up to. Uh, is there any gaps in there? Any holes that, are sh that shouldn't be there? Uh, no, I don't think so. I mean, obviously, um... Like, like there are gaps where the archways are, but that's but uh, uh, but obviously it like, like it's meant to look like that, isn't it? Because that that uh, that's part of the design, I'm pretty sure. Yeah, that's for structural support. Yeah. <laughs> um, and the launch pads—is everything looking okay? 
Like, there's like nothing. There's no. There's no like weird things that shouldn't be there. There's nothing that can be flammable in there. Uh, concrete powder will not be flammable, so that's all good. Is there any like just anything flammable there, down there? No. I, well, east. I don't see anything. Uh, uh, Bonga, do you see anything? Uh, no, I don't see anything. Everything looks to be all good. Yeah, uh, uh, yeah, everything looks all good, Dr. Cali. Don't worry, I think. Is that everything? Uh, yeah, I think that should be everything. Let me just make sure. Um, if you can go back in and then just literally just have a little look around, make sure there's no... There's n everything sh everything's where it should be. Oh. Um... Just make sure. Um, is the is the light on? Okay. Yep, the light's on. Okay, that's good. Um, are the screens on? This we don't want the screens on right now. Oh. Um. I think. Yeah, do you want me to do you want me to turn those off? Um. If. if because well, it's okay. We don't. It's okay if we have them on, but it's kind of like wasting money right now. So I just just turn it off, I guess, for now. Okay, okay. Um, there we go. Oh, uh, thank you, Bonga. Um, right. Uh, so that's that. I think that's it. Uh, for up here. Um, do you want to go downstairs now? Yeah, just make your make sure that everything that everything looks okay. And there's no like. Holes, because you never know. It, it it could be it could be fine on the outside, but then when you look on the inside, it's actually terrible. Uh, no, no holes. Everything looks exactly as it should be. Got all the shulk boxes here. We've got an armor stand, a crafting table, some a couple of beacons, a pain in the bed. Um, yep, yeah, even the beds here. Um, yeah, we've got some. Uh, got some nice carpet here as well. I think, yeah, that's, that, I think that's basically it. Yeah, well, uh, if you could just make your way out, then, um, and just close everything, make sure everything's okay, and then, uh, just head on down past Domino's, then, um, yeah, you should be all good. Um, so the mission has been delayed ever so slightly to May 7th, not that much of a worry, though. Oh, oh, okay. Um, uh, can I just ask, uh, Dr. Callia, um, how come you decided to, uh, delay, um, h how come you decided to delay the, the launch, the, the rocket launch? Because, well, we were missing a part of the rocket and we wanted to delay it just, uh, just by a couple of days just to make sure that we got that part in time. It was, uh, one of the windows. We were missing a part of, of the window, and we just wanted to make sure that it was there in time, so we delayed it by a couple of days. But, um, yeah, it's all good now. So, uh, yeah, yeah, it's just it's still gonna happen. It's still it's still delayed though, but not. It's literally only two days that we've delayed it by. Uh, yeah, I mean, we are. I mean, we are still launching. Our, uh, we are still gonna be launching our attack early, of course, because obviously, um, King Bong what. King Bong wants to blow up the planet on May 10th, which obviously, like, we're launching our, we're launching our attack May 7th, so we're still, so we are still going to be early, so it's not the end of the world, Dr. Cali, don't worry. Yeah, well, um, I've, now that that's all done, you've got your little briefing on how everything works, um, we should uh, be all good, and I will talk to you for the launch day on May seventh. Okay, Dr. Kelly, I'll speak. To, I'll speak to you soon. Speak to you soon. Bye. Well, well um, that, um that. Daisy, um, can I can I ask a little favor? Yeah, what's up? Can can I can I just like. Can you, can you quickly run to your house and get some scaffolding? I know we do this quite a lot, but can we just build up to a to Bongi ship? Because uh, I, I, there's not really any way for me to get his attention right now, and he's kind of sitting in the air. So I kind yeah. of don't really have any way to get up. So if that's okay, if we can really quickly just go to your house and just get that. Uh, yeah, sure. I, mean, I know you and Bongi. I mean, 
As far as I'm aware, you and Bongi are exactly like. Uh, um, I mean, I don't know. Like, um, I, I don't really want to like assume if like, anything's going on between you two. I mean, I know you lost that bet one time, and um, has Bongi been um, has Bongi been ignoring you by any chance, Bonga? I don't know, we've been getting along. We like we're not like best friends, but like we're we're like acquaintances, if you know what I mean. Oh yes, I know exactly what acquaintances are. Oh, you wanna go this way? Um I was gonna go the other way, but we can go this way. Uh that, 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 that that's perfectly fine. Um yeah, I should still have some scaffolding. Um Yeah, I mean I I, I normally keep scaffolding in my house, so I'm pretty sure. I mean, I, I, I did um, I did actually take some recently. Oh yes, I've I've got plenty. I've still got plenty. Um, right. Um, yeah. Let's get you back to Bongi ship and I guess I guess this is goodbye until until launch day, Bonga. Yeah. Well. Um. Uh, I, it's, it's gonna be weird, uh, it's gonna be a weird day, for sure, but I think we'll, we'll definitely get through it. Yeah, I, I don't think, I think this is gonna be the last time that I see you now, like, like, not until, not until launch day, so, y yeah, we've got just under a month now. Yeah, well, um, I think, um, I hope everything goes to plan. I mean, I think we're safe in the rocket, but yeah. I think just like everything on Galactica, and I hope they don't blow up the world. I don't want anyone to die. Like you never know. You never know. The coots, like all of a sudden, just decide to do it early and decide to do it on May seventh. So that's why we have to act fast, so no one dies. Yeah, true. But even if things do go wrong, Bonga, just know we're all in this together, okay? Yeah. So and despite the evils like like King Bong, uh, they, they can't take away the memories that we made. Yeah, exactly. Like, even if we all die, we're all, we're all in this together. So, um, I, I mean, of course, like, I... Really don't want to lose world. I really don't want to lose any of my friends. But uh, like I said, even if things do go wrong, like uh, we're all in this together, and uh, you know we all have each other's backs. So uh, yeah, uh, you uh, you do have a point, um, Bonger, about uh, you know uh, memories and stuff. So uh, yeah, I just need to. Um, Okay, just need to place a little bit more scaffold in. Um, I think, okay, um, I think, yeah, just a few more, uh, just a, just a few more, um, blocks. Um, yeah, I think. Maybe, maybe one more, maybe one or two more up. Oh, okay. There you go. Okay. Maybe you should just um, be able to build over now. Need to build, like, I think we need to... I think now I need to build, I think, whoops, um, I've got to try and bu build a bridge now. Oh, you, you might need to help me out here, Bonger, a little bit. <laughs> you might need to help me out. Are you whoops. not able to just place it forward? Oh. Oh, yeah. Like yeah. I, I, uh, I, uh, forgot. I forgot I could do that. Um... Yeah, there we go. That should be safe enough. Um. Well. Yeah. We yeah. just gotta make sure that we play our that that we play our part to perfection. Yeah. Well. Um. JC, it's been a, it's been fun, but um, I will talk to you on on the big mission day. I this is this is gonna be weird, but I hope everything goes to plan. So Same. yeah. Um. See you around, JC. Um. I will see you on March seventh. See, see, do you mean May 7th? Yeah, May 7th, sorry. Oh, no, oh, oh, oh no, it's fine, it's fine. But, yeah, I'll, uh, I will see you soon, Bonga. Bye. Bye.
Man, what what a long day it has been today, but uh, it's getting late now, the sun's going down, so uh, I'm gonna is Erica in bed? Oh, hey Erica, are you still awake? Yeah, I'm still awake. So how are we watching? Uh, I'm just watching a little plant show. How'd it go, JC? Uh it went really well actually. So uh the attack is delayed ever so slightly by two days, so on May 7th, uh, that's when we'll be launching our attack, instead of May 5th. Oh yeah, I know. I'm, I'm helping fight. Oh yeah, of course you are, because you're, uh, you're a part of the ground team, um, aren't you? Yeah, me, I think it's like me, Lily, RM, CJ, Iris, Luke, Batman. Like, literally, like, so many people are helping. And even Richard. Wait, what? Wait, what? Why Richard's only four years old? Why? Why? Uh, why are we drafting Richard to war? Oh, no. it's He's not going to be doing much. He's literally going to be shooting a bow and arrow from, like, a balcony or whatever. That's all he's going to do. Oh, okay. I mean, to be fair, though, he did... Um, he, uh, he did learn, like, he did learn how to use a bow and arrow at nursery anyway, so, uh, that should be okay. Yeah, well, um, I think it's getting pretty late now. Uh, the sun's pretty much gone down. Yeah. I say we, uh, just, uh, start heading off the bed, off the bed in a second. Yeah. Well, um, uh, it's gonna be, it's gonna be weird on, on May... May 7th, but uh, mm. yeah, uh, I'll just turn the TV off now. And, uh, right, yeah, yeah uh, we can uh, go to bed. Good night, JC. Love you. Good night, Erica. Love you too.